up? I'm not one of the upgrade guys, and today we're gonna take you through some ways you can start to understand your shoulder car better. Remember, a shoulder car is an example of what your shoulder is currently capable of. It tells you how good your shoulder is, and it gives you an idea of how much of that space you can use. So, the things we will give you today are not for you to use for training to make your shoulder better necessarily. They're the things you would use to, in, to uh, flesh out that benefit you've received from getting some space in the shoulder. A lot of times when we gain more space that we didn't have before, we don't really know how to use it. So once you gain the space, which is a different tool, a different thing, you can come here and you can get better at using that space. It's not enough to just get more range of motion, you have to know how to use that range of motion. I'm going to use a half kneeling position as an example here. And the first one I'm gonna show you is I'm up against the wall. And I've got my arm locked out here, and then I'm going to begin the shoulder car. You'll see that because the wall is blocking my torso, um, I can't shift to the side. And if I rotate, I'm going to feel it through my torso. I'm going to feel it on my shoulder. So when I do a shoulder car here, I've got some pieces of feedback that I can use, right? And I'm on one knee, so I've got a little bit of a um, demand already in terms of recognizing where my stability lies. So that's just using a wall. Pretty easy, right? What if I want to take that a step further? Well, I really want to check my torso. So now I'm like, hey, I don't want to knock this foam roller over, right? And I don't want to, and I, I don't want to bother it. And I'm going to do the same thing. Because the foam roller is light and we understand that and we have a lot of experience with this object and how easy it is to move, when we go to do this movement, our brain is going to perceive it in a different way and we're going to uh, get a lot more feedback and we're going to be paying a lot more attention to things that we might not have, uh, might not have been uh, super apparent before. So these are some ways you can start to think about how to increase your benefit once you've gained some range in, in your shoulder. And uh, we hope you enjoyed it. If you do, please hit like, share it, let people know, subscribe. We are also on Instagram and all social platforms as The Upgrade Guys. Much love. Upgrade your shit.